Hi everyone, Spectrum here. We're going to talk about armaments and shipyards. Okay, so that's what everybody wants to know. How do I make stuff to blow up things and how do I make my ship bigger? So that's what we're here to talk about today. Alright, uh, real quick, basics. Question mark takes you to the wiki. Moving horizontally across allows you to access products. And so if I come here, I have cannons and fighters and here I have torpedoes, probes, and missiles, okay? All right, so let's take a look at all how all this works. So Armament has three basic products right now, and uh, one of the things that we hope to expand during early access is the number of products that we can build with Armaments. We want to expand this and start building um, cooler weapons. So for now and today, we have t basically torpedoes, and torpedoes um, do 450 damage, they ignore shields, and they do a lot of damage to a ship in hyperspace. Torpedoes are not used in normal space. Next we have probes. Probes are used to be able to probe other systems. Um, they are launched from hyperspace, but they will fly into normal space, returning to your ship. Now, you don't have to build thousands and thousands and thousands of these because you put 10 on your ship and they will launch, scout the system, and return. So there's no need, they are not fire and forget and never see them again. Next we have missiles. Missiles are a unique item. They uh, uh, are fired from hyperspace the same as um, probes, but they have a range of warheads and it depends on how much energy that you can put into a missile. Now we'll go into more of this when we're in combat, but an empty missile basically flies very, very fast and uh, hits the target. It never loses target, even if the other ship dumps, you know, tries to get away. It will hunt them down until they end or the missile is destroyed. Okay, so that's armament. So let's take a look at how that works. So I'm going to come in here, and I'm going to weird now have no dots, but I also don't have anybody working in armaments. So let's go 0.74, because as we've learned already, my capacity is 0.74, and now I have 450 workers in armaments. Okay, so we'll come down here. Now, 450 workers, they use two metals each, and you have an output of 13. That 13 is divided across the number of products that you have. So right now, a torpedo costs half of a production, a probe costs five, and a missile costs two. So taking our 13 divided evenly, I'm gonna get eight probes per hour, 0.89 of, oh sorry, I'm going to get five, almost nine torpedoes, 0.89 probes, and two missiles every hour. Okay, so what if I want to focus on probes? I come up and I put one dot into probes, because remember uh, the, the math calculation is the number of dots divided by the total dots. So there's one dot here. I am now going to get all of the 13 divided by 5, which will give me 2.67 probes per hour. Okay. Now if I decide I want some missiles in there too, now it takes our 13, and because there's one dot in probes divided by a total of two dots, so half is going to go into this and half is going to go into that. So half of 13 with a cost of 5, I'm going to get 1.3. 13, missile, cost of 2, I'm going to get 3. But if I want probes, now this will be a total of 4 dots, divide by 3, so 75% will go into probes. So now I'm going to get 2 probes every hour and just about a little bit over 1.5 missiles per hour. So you can see how that works. So I'm going to turn all my dots off because I don't want anything because I'm going to set this back to 0. Okay. Now, shipyards. You'll notice on the left side over here, dry dock holes. Now, if you hit the question mark, the wiki will tell you how many holes is needed per ship's size. Okay? So, three holes will be a basic shipyard 
and you'll look, you'll look at the wiki to find out how to build a a shipyard that has a five hull capacity okay so right now I'm just gonna come in here and I'm gonna put point oh, yeah, seven three and I'm gonna get 447 workers in here and now the products are cannons which are surface guns or fighters okay so I have 447 workers it takes 5.2 metal per worker which gives me a production output of 34 per hour now fighters cost or, or cannons cost a hundred units of production and I'm going to get 0.17 so it's going to take me several hours just to build one cannon now if you want to defend your base a cannon is significantly better than a fighter and a cannon basically a surface gun will be able to take out multiple fighters before a fighter can bomb it so this is a very good value for defense if you want to build offensive and defensive then use fighters because fighters will defend your base and you can pull fighters off of the base and go off to uh, attack someone else's planet and I'm going to get 0.3 per hour so if I only want to build fighters here again just put one dot in because that will be one divide by one which is hundred percent and now I'm going to get 0.69 fighters per hour okay so there you go that is armaments and shipyards